Hello there and welcome to tonight's video. Now tonight I'm here at Heaven Shopping Centre in the actual shopping precinct and I didn't realise that there's these lights here so this is handy. Um, yes I know I prefer to do in the, in the dark but since these lights are here and it's chucking it down with rain I thought I might as well take advantage of the lights you know. Uh, I've still got night vision on it keeps going on and off because I've got it set to uh, automatic. Um, but I'm going to see if there is anyone here who, uh, of the spirit variety, who might possibly want to communicate with me. And uh, also, I'm right next to the, um, I believe, the flats where um, quite a few years ago, sadly, some uh, people jumped from the flats. So I was told by a good friend of mine a while ago. Um, so that was very sad, uh, obviously. People, um, doing something like that so anyway I've always wanted to investigate around here so I thought I'll uh, try where it's quiet but there is a possibility that some people could come along obviously with it being such a uh, public place and all that so anyway let's uh, see if I can uh, pick anything up it might not be the best because you can hear the sound of the rain and stuff that might interfere with any possible EVPs but I'll give it a go anyway so let's get going then let's get started Hello, is there anyone here with me right now? My name's Gordon. Now, I don't know many of the shops um, down here too well, because I don't actually come here really. I've been here in the past, but um, not recently. So, um, yeah, I know that one over there, that Reed's Rain's place, I know that one, bro. I believe a lot of the shots, shops here have shut down and everything. So, that's unfortunate, but, and over there, you should be able to see, there is the, uh, I was told that is the block of flats where, as I say, some uh, people sadly uh, chose to uh, jump from the windows, I believe, somewhere, I don't know which floor, but, um, I'm not sure how high that building is, but it's pretty high. It's not as high as like a New York skyscraper or anything, but it's still pretty tall. And then they knocked some of the um, flats down a few years ago. I think this is the only. Um, I think this is the main, the main big one that's left. I don't think there's any more left. I don't think so anyway. I may be wrong because I, I don't come up here too often. But um, and plus I'm in the dark, so. Anyway, we'll see if, um, we'll continue to see if there's anyone around here, but I can't go outside of this canopy because my camera will get wet, and we don't want that. I think it may be water resistant, but I'm not sure. Right then. Hello? Is there anyone here with me right now? My name's Gordon. Some noises over there, I don't know what that is, but I think it's cars or something. Sounds like a motorbike actually, I hope it's not coming in here. Actually I'm not sure what is in here. It's like a, um, it's a scooter or something.
loud scooter, I must say. <laughs> it's a bit windy down here, I must admit. Something knocking in my pocket. I thought someone walking alongside of us there. Hello, is anyone here with me right now? Could you please tell me your name? My name's Gordon. Oh, tripping over something. That's always what happens when I go out, I always end up tripping over something. It's just a piece of metal or something, nothing much. If there's somebody here, can you please tell me your name? Can you see the red lights I'm holding in my hand? If you can speak into these red lights, I should be able to record your voice. Again. 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 I guess that's meant to be a seat there in the middle of the in the middle of the um, thing here, whatever you call it, the path. If there's someone here, did you used to live around here somewhere? Is there anyone here who used to live in those flats around the corner there? The tall flats, the big ones? I can't, I can't really go over next to the flats because there's no... I don't think there's any shelter in places over there from, from the rain. Unfortunately, because when I when I left the house tonight, I didn't realise it was actually raining until I got out the door. <laughs> so I didn't think I was going to be able to investigate tonight because because of the rain. But I didn't realise this was all lit up and there was a canopy here protecting you from the rain. So yeah, it's a pity I couldn't go over right next to the flats themselves right now. But it's a bit of a risk because uh, my camera. I don't want to get soaking wet. So, I just have to do it from here. Is there anyone here that can see me and hear me? My friend used to live around here in one of the flats, not those ones, but a different block. I don't even know if that's still there, to be honest. Um, is there anybody here that knows anything about um, people jumping from those flats over there from high up from a window? And that is a phone box over there with an advert for McDonald's on it. I think I'll not be going to McDonald's for a while again, I don't think. After what they've been doing recently. Um. Hello, is anyone here? If there is anyone here, I don't know if you're aware of this, but I cannot see you, but, and I probably won't be able to hear you either, but I can record your voice with this camera, if you would be so kind as to speak to me.
my foot. If there was a noise there, I heard a noise, it was my foot sticking to the ground or something. They put all these fences up here, I don't know. I think they're building something or something, I'm not sure. They're always building something somewhere around here, I know that much. But I don't know what they're building, I haven't got a clue. Does anyone know what they're building here? Next to the flats in Heaven Shopping Centre area? Well, there's a there's a slight breeze right now. Don't know if it's affecting the mic on the camera for um, any possible EVPs that I might or might not pick up. Um, I don't know where it is, but um, strangely enough, lately when I've been um, like my last few uh, videos that I've put put on here, nobody has seems to have uh, heard anything that I've um, recorded, like EVPs. You know, um, ghost voices and stuff. I, I'm not sure why that is, because if you wear some headphones, you should be able to at least hear some of them, because I certainly can. So I'm assuming some other people will also be able to hear them. Some of them at least. So um, if you could be so kind, the people watching this video, if you could let me know if you do hear anything on this video, any voices that doesn't appear to be mine, or on any of my previous videos before this one I will be very interested to hear from you and I'll be very uh, grateful if you could do that if, you, if you've got a spare moment but it's best to listen on the headphones like I say and turn the volume right up as high as you can is there anyone here at all with me right now? Right, well I've decided to try inside of this um, rather um, rather posh um, phone box here. As you can see, it isn't vandalized or anything, that's that's a good thing. Well, I'm just being um, facetious because it's vandalized to bits. But, well look here, we've got a phone box at all in this day and age because the, the one that was next to my house has uh, long since uh, been removed, so, um, you know. So, at least there's a phone box here, yeah, that's, that's a good thing I guess. But how much longer will this phone box actually be here for? That is the question. Right, anyway, besides that... Hang it. And it actually works as well, funnily enough. It's a bit dusty-like. Look at the state of this. Dusty phone box. A dusty phone in a vandalized phone box. Right, anyway. I'm not, I'm not actually going to make any calls right now, but I am going to attempt to uh, try some communi communication inside of here, but there is the loud sound of uh, rain on the roof. Well, it's not too bad, I suppose. Right, let's get started on this one then. Right then, is there anyone here in this phone box with me right now? If there is, could you please tell me your full name, as loud as you can, if possible?
Once again, could you please tell me your full name and could you shout it into that flashing red light if possible? I'd be very uh, grateful if you could. Can you see the red light flashing in my left hand? Anyone? Because uh, remember, I don't know if you heard us when I was over there, but I can't actually see you or hear you. But if you speak into the red light, I should be to record you speaking onto the camera. So if you could give me your full name, your first name and your second name, I will try to get in contact with some of your friends or family if you would like that. And, and if you've got a message you would like me to give them, if you could just say the message into the red light, please. And if you would like to give a message to any f friends or family, could you give me um, the, the, na the full name of the person that you would like me to give the message to? Because I'll do my best to help you if I can. If you've got any questions for your, I don't know, your family or your friends or anyone. Just say their names and I'll try and pass a message on. Now I can't stay here too long because uh, it's chucking it down outside of here. And I've got to go back in the rain and get drenched. <laughs> so... But thanks very much if you did speak to me, because I don't know if you have yet until I check my recording back. Right, I have just managed to uh, come over to the actual entrance to this uh, block of flats. And the uh, automatic door keeps opening for some reason. But I don't think that's paranormal or anything. It's probably just because I got my arm held out. And it's uh, messing with the sensor thing. The detector or whatever you call it. That opens the door. Anyway, um, at least there's a shelter here. I didn't think there was one, but there actually is. There's a little canopy over the door here. And what have you. I don't fancy going in there because... I don't know if you're allowed to go in there when you're not actually visiting anyone. So I don't think I'll be doing that. Anyway, I can't stay here much longer. Kiss her. Kiss her, kiss her, kiss her, kiss her. I don't know whether I'm supposed to, I don't know. I suppose it's alright to be here, but, um, because it is a good shelter from the rain for the minute. Right, I'm going to try and see if there's anyone here with me. I don't know if you'll be able to hear very well if anyone speaks because of the rain and everything. But, let's give it a shot. Is there anyone here with me right now? Hello? Hello, my name's Gordon, by the way. Um, I don't mean any any harm if there's someone here. I can't actually see you if there is someone with me right now because, um, well, I don't know why I can't see you, but um, I guess it's because you're not actually no longer with us type of thing. But the thing is, um, I can't actually hear you for the most part either. Sometimes I can hear some of you speaking out loud, but it's on rare occasions. Um... But if you speak into these red lights here, I should be able to record your voice if you would be willing to speak to me right now.
Could you please tell me your full name? And I don't mean you any harm, like I say, I've just come here to try and communicate with you. And if you would like me to, I could try and pass a message on to somebody. Uh, maybe a family member or, or um, yeah, you know, a friend or something. Have you got any friends or family members you would like to uh, give a message to? Or ask questions or anything? If you would like to do that, you would have to give me your full name and their names as well, if that's possible. Because I would have to find them. I don't know if you... Do you know what the internet is? Well, there's people on the internet on certain websites. There's a website called Facebook. Are you familiar with Facebook? Well, as you might know, I might not, Facebook has some local groups on it uh, where you can uh, get in touch with local people and stuff. So what I was thinking was, if you have any family members that you would like to give a message to, maybe they might be on Facebook, on, on the internet. Bit of a long shot, I know, but um, if I can hear what you're saying, if you speak to me right now, I'll try my best to do that for you, if you want. But I will need you to shout your full first name and second name as close to them red lights as possible. going to walk over there but better not because it's going to cause the door to open and shut all the time <laughs> right I must also ask you I don't know if there's anyone with me I can't see you like I say but if you are here whoever is here do you know anything about anyone jumping from these flats years ago from from high up one of the windows Is there anyone here that knows anything about people jumping from the top of these flats out of the windows years ago? If you're one of the people who did jump um, all those years ago, I'm really sorry to hear that that happened, first of all. And I must ask um, right now, um, how are you right now? Are you, are you okay at the minute? Because I have no idea um, who, who did do that. I just heard some rumours, you know, from friends a while back. So if you could please tell me your first and second name, I'd be very grateful. Right, well, if you, if you did speak to me right now, like I say, I don't know if you did or not until I play the recording back on this camera. Um, I must thank you very much for um, speaking to me. I really appreciate it. It's very kind of you. I have to go now because it's chucking it down with rain. I've got to get back home and stuff. And um, so thanks very much for speaking to me. And maybe I'll speak to you again sometime, maybe, if you want us to. Um, just let us, you can shout into there if you want us to come back or not. Um, and I'll, if I hear what you said, I'll, I'll uh, respect your wishes either way if you want us to come back or not. So thanks very much once again. Right, I'm going to uh, finish off now because it's um, not a very, very good night with the weather and everything. Um, so I'd just like to uh, thank everyone for watching this video once again. 
And please, can you let me know if you do hear any voices? But like I say, you can actually record the voices of people who have passed away. And you can ask them questions, and a lot of the, the time they do answer you. And you can, uh, they ask you questions as well, some of them. But anyway, thanks for watching everyone, and I shall see you on the next video. So don't forget to give us a like if you enjoyed this video. And uh, don't forget to subscribe if you would like to see more videos from me in the future. And um, yeah, thanks for watching, and for now.